Before there was Javain Bryan, there was. Anderson with a shot and it's in the back of the net. Yeah, my name is Jeremy and Tuffy Anderson and I play for Warthog. Tuffy's journey began in Granville, St. James. Raised in a large household with nine sisters and seven brothers, he attended Granville All Age School and later Montego Bay Secondary. His strong and chunky build earned him the nickname, Tuffy. Starting at Granville United, he quickly caught the eye of Seba United in 2003, but Anderson failed to settle and at the end of the year he departed again, this time to Wadada. In the 2006-2007 season Wadada were condemned to relegation and understandably, Anderson wanted to play in the top tier. He knew he would need to play at the highest level if he wanted to go places. So in came Waterhouse and the rest is history. Over five seasons, he scored an impressive 52 goals in 98 appearances. Tuffy became the top goalscorer in the Red Stripe Premier League for three consecutive seasons, solidifying his status as a local football hero. His prolific 2012-13 campaign, with 21 goals, remains etched in the memories of supporters. His goals went on to propel the team to a cup victory when Waterhouse won the 2013 Flow Cup. Good win for your team today. How are you feeling after the win? The same season, seeking new challenges, Tuffy moved to Central America, playing for Deportivo Agula in El Salvador. His impact was immediate, scoring six times in 15 matches, showcasing his skills on an international stage. But it wasn't a long visit as he returned to Waterhouse in 2014. In 2002, Tuffy made his debut for the Jamaica national team. However, his standout moment came during the 2014 World Cup qualifiers, where fans passionately rallied for his inclusion. Jamaica was in the middle of a poor losing streak in hexagonal World Cup qualifying. Defeat to Honduras in San Pedro Sula was still very much fresh in the minds of the reggae boys faithful, and with goals scarce, the fans clamoured for a striker who could put the ball in the back of the net. Anderson was in fine form for Waterhouse and eventually, Manager Winfried Schaefer granted the fans their wish and called him up for fixtures against both Panama and Costa Rica. It was against the Costa Ricans when Anderson really made his mark. That goal is a goal that I have to remember and it's a moment for me through life. I know so boy, I even played my first World Cup qualifier for the country. In the end, Tuffy only made a meagre 12 appearances, scoring twice. He even made a few runouts for Jamaica's national beach football team. In the 2016, however, Waterhouse parted ways with Tuffy. The Drusland outfit, the second most active club during the off-season, said the split was mutual as they will be looking to get back to their glory days with a younger set of players. From there he went to Boys Town before again moving on to the Olympic Gardens FC at the age of 40. Even at the age of 43, his love for football had him still going in the major league playing for New Kingston. That man some more time coming like my young boy, Kathy Garn, he had goal in a four games. Kathy does call it, say, so like I'm here at the marksman in the major league. But there are some good little youth, them show love and respect, you know, them try to fight the game and win, they try to fight the ball. And, you know, them always are look for me, you know, because they tell me of them idol and things. You know, as I say, I show them love and respect to me. But say, you know, me as a youth, I always sit and ready to you, me, and no matter what this can come out of me, I don't say, say, you know, this, the Almighty give me that. Skill, I can't do it. But more time in our life, people want to try to tell you when to stop. People want to tell you. Man, here, John, is sitting at the top play football, man. Mentally, and your mind and your body. In the end, his unofficial JPL record for Waterhouse stands at an impressive 73 goals in 131 appearances, leaving no doubt why he's a Jamaica Premier League legend. All of them defend and free me you now because they know it's not an easy task. As I said, that's why I said this work just build me to go in the league. But I don't fear the no defender right now. I know them fear me right now because when them going to bed at night time, boy, oh my man, that boy tough. They know that big chunk boy. They are now man. But when they go to bed, me no no problem because me being there and doing that, me just know it's just that my team. Clear them right now for just cheer some back and give me right now for score goal.
If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for all things Jamaica Premier League. Tuffy and the same man make the mesh pop. Blow a wall in a that hundred and watt. Coming like a hundred volt when it's shock. Blow a wall in a that. Tuffy and the same.